Well, welcome back to Channel Ron. Today I'm going to be showing you how to remove the keys on an upright uh, piano. Uh, this is something that's uh, very simple to do. We're going to be reconditioning all these keys in some time. Uh, we'll be doing them one at a time, so I want to just show you how simple it is to remove the keys. So let's go ahead and get started. Okay, so first thing what we need to do is we need to put the top up, and uh, you may find that yours may open uh, a little bit differently, but we need to kind of access this area first. Then once you do that, there's going to be two little clips on either side. You're going to lift those up. Once you've done that, just kind of wiggle that a little bit and you should be able to pull the whole face of that piano right off. Okay, now that that's all done, you're going to have the top piece where your sheet music sits and there's going to be two flathead screws, one here and one here. So just take a regular screwdriver and remove those. Place those someplace, you're not going to lose them. And you should be able to just go ahead and grab that, wiggle it just a little bit. It should pull right out of there. So there's the next piece. Get that out of the way. Okay, now we've got the lid we need to take off. And we're going to have another screw on this side. Okay, flathead, just like the cover was. I'm going to remove that one. This one. And that too, just wiggle it around a little bit, should pop right out of there. Just like that. Kind of neat to see this all in operation here. I kind of like it better this way than the other way. Um, but anyways, so once you get the uh, tops and the covers and everything all taken off, as, as you can see, there's not a lot to this. Find the key that you're going to be repairing or replacing. We're going to be doing all the key tops on here eventually. So all you need to do is find the key, you're going to lift up on that ever so slightly. You might find yourself having to tip it ahead just ever so slightly uh, so you don't disturb the hammer or break off any more of the parts. And then once you have it, you're good to go. So uh, we can kind of clean this up. I'm going to replace uh, the key top and then we'll put it back in here after I vacuum this all out. Don't be afraid to take more than one out because they're all numbered as well uh, and you can kind of confirm that with yours. Uh, but they really will only go in one way for the most part. So once you've replaced the new key top, all you have to do is very carefully just kind of set that back down in there like that. And there it is. Good to go. So I hope that kind of helps you on uh, replacing the key tops on yours. I'm not going to be showing that right now. I'm just kind of, right now all I'm doing is kind of getting everything all cleaned up and prepping everything for the new key top. So thanks an awful lot for watching and we'll see you on the next one. like this. <laughs>